think while uh, a lot of strides are being made in many other sectors, the uh, construction industry is lagging behind. And uh, until and unless the construction industry doesn't come up with solutions, I'm afraid we are not going to be able to find really strong solutions for reducing carbon emissions in the world. Because 40% of the carbon emissions are attributed to the way we are building at the moment. At the moment now, uh, worldwide and particularly in India, we have all the technologies that it requires to be able to bring down carbon emissions in buildings by 60 to 70 percent. And not only that, it's not going to be expensive. In fact, we can even bring down costs by 20 percent. So I think we are at that tipping point where if we bring finance, policy, construction providers together with the necessary incentives, we will be able to start creating the necessary projects that changes the mindset of people vis-a-vis -vis their obsession with concrete and steel and glass and aluminium, which are some of the biggest carbon killers that we not being able to find an alternative for. I think we are still st stuck in that mindset and the technology framework. When sustainable housing was done, primarily for the rich. It was a luxury that you had a mud uh, farmhouse or something like that. And that is why the vendors that were there at that time were also uh, providing to a clientele which could afford to pay very heavily. Artisans were very few. The management systems around delivery of uh, this kind of buildings was uh, niche. Whereas over the last, uh, I'd say about 15 years or so, things have changed drastically. Uh, we have uh, a huge number of practices uh, that are addressing this issue. There is a lot of research that has now gone into developing this vocabulary for India. And uh, uh, we are in a position now to bring it all together uh, to be able to deliver on this. I think uh, the correct players need to come together now. Especially uh, uh, what Kutum is trying to do, for example, is bring a financing group together along with uh, uh, medium-scale contractors and developers and the governments. And uh, so that the policy measures are put in place, the necessary incentives are put in place, the uh, delivery mechanism is uh, willing to take the challenge and the financiers are there to, uh, to deliver. The customers are ready to buy now. I believe it's the, uh, if these three players were to come together, I think we will be setting benchmarks in how uh, large-scale uh, sustainable building projects can be delivered. I'm here because there's a strong finance agency with a large number of developers who are willing to listen. And uh, this combination, along with our abilities to deliver on such projects, can provide a platform for creating these flagship projects which will make uh, uh, the necessary shift in the mindset of people uh, that this is possible. Thank you.